Oh, so unfitted to have been 35. I still wouldn't have stopped. <laughs> I 45 I got down to 27, so at uh, um, at 35 I would have got down to, what, 17? Never mind. Right. Now, let me find uh, this and I'll get the thing switched over. Right, I'm in a new area of the route. Right, so... What we don't need is all of this rubbish down the left hand side. So you can go and you can go. And you can go and you can go. And you can go. Right, okay. So, and this is the turntable tutorial. So we kind of got it right the last time. It's just it failed right at the end, really annoyingly. Um, right, so. If we lay some tracks. So what I said, one of the things I said at the last tutorial was um, just tip about having multiple um, when you click on here so you'll notice I've just got TSA track uh, and if I was to click on Soldier Summit you'll see some different track appear I've got all of it in here and if I was to start clicking some of this track it wouldn't actually work properly you should only ever click it from the current track rule so find the track rule that gives you the track that you want so let's just stick with the Academy and then pick your track from here um, so if you uh, if we just pick the track um, and let's um, let's set it to uh, yard so we can get some sensible turns. Um, and we will just I don't know why it does that. Never mind. Uh, and we'll lay a bit of straight track, and then we'll come over here. And we'll lay another bit of straight track. Right. And right click just to get rid of it. Now what I'm going to do is I'm going to leave a bit of a gap for us to start our train, and then I'm going to draw another bit of track coming out here. So let me just change that to yard. I mean, see that it's joined, drawn the point correctly. Right. So, uh, let me just pull that you know, one up there and we'll carry it on up here. Just so we've got plenty to work with. And then we'll come off here with a point. And we will go up to, I don't know, let's say there. And that's where we will do our turntable. So, if you want to do a turntable, there's a couple of ways you can do it. There's a hard way, there's an easy way. The last time I showed the hard way, and to be honest, I'm not going to do that this time, because frankly, it's just the wrong way of doing it. If you've got a piece of, if you, so if you're starting from your turntable, you can just drop your turntable in and draw track out from it. Yep. So you click this, you click your track, you click to the arrow will join onto it like that, and then you draw your track. There you go, you've drawn your track. That's it, that's all you need to know, right? Let's not do that. Right. I've in most cases you will already have root and you decide you want the turntable joined up to that root. And what you could do try and do is draw track and then try joining and merging and welding and all sorts of complicated things but what you can do is you can just use um, the join tool so if you click the join tool up in the top left here and uh, you click the turntable and then you click the track the turntable will automatically join to it and that's all you need to do so from that point on your turntable is now in in your world and it's usable and you can now build from it so let's build some track out uh, we'll go to mainline again. Let's set it back to yard. So we will build our one here, and I'm going to press the control key so that it merges. And let's do another one over here. Get back to main. Let's a yard. We'll do one there, and again let's merge it. And then the other thing you might want to do is to do some storage sidings. So let's do. I want to make sure it definitely is snapped and hasn't come off. Put that storage siding in there, and then we can put that storage siding. I'm just it's for sometimes that's not the mouse isn't the the cursor is not appearing. It's because it's you'll see it's trying to do the next thing up here. If you right click, then you'll get the mouse pointer back, ready to do the next thing. And if you right click again, it will get rid of it entirely. So that's the turntables, and that's how you build them. Get it, join it up with the old route to do it the first time, um, and um, and then you can um, build out from the turntable. 
you obviously can't join a second one in, so you want to join in once and then build out from the turntable. Don't don't try and get complicated with it. Right. Now, the other thing that came up and where it all went horribly wrong was how do you get rid of the grass from in here? And I tried to use a decal and all went horribly, horribly wrong. Um, don't use the decal. I I'm sure that decals are probably a way that the professionals use it, but I just couldn't make it work right. I've tried it a little while and it just wouldn't work the way that I wanted it to. So I'm going to use the uh, lower terrain tool. So I I'm setting the thing down so that the tool is relatively small, relatively slow, and you'll see we just start lowering the terrain here and you can see the turntable start to appear you've got a little bit of flexibility because um, there's actually a fair bit of um, this 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 sort of effect here goes out quite a way and uh, you'll you'll take a lot more time over it and you'll do a much better job of it that I'm sure but essentially that is your turntable you just lower the terrain out of the way um, and then you can perhaps bring some of it back up just to tidy up what's going on around here um, you can like I said you can use the decal I did try the decal I kind of got it working I just didn't like how it looked to be honest um, Stephen Jam says you can just set the height to minus three that's another way of doing it but there you go turntables working isn't that good uh, the other thing I covered just so that it's uh, we cover the same things is someone asked about manual and automatic junctions I've done that in a previous tutorial but for those that have missed it uh, if you want to change that junction it's currently a manual it's got the lever if you want to change it back then you want to cut the junction so use the cut tool which is the split the sorry the split tool and you want to split it so making sure that it's snapped onto the yellow the red triangle here and then cut it now if we now switch that so that it's um, set to automatic by unticking it and then use the um, the weld and weld it back you'll see it's now changed to being an automatic junction so one more time just to show it again cut it make sure the yellow is uh, the yellow arrow is on it uh, change to what you want and then weld and it's gone back to being a uh, a junction you see it's all properly rendered it's all correct type of junction if you're not getting junctions rendering correctly it means you're not doing this whole track selection thing getting your track rules track types and all of that stuff set correctly right so that is um, turntables and uh, some of the other stuff around track that I wanted to cover um, the next thing I wanted to cover was asset blocks this won't take very long so with asset blocks, 